Hi, I'm Bob Sowers, Director of Construction here at Kinsale. Today, I, haven't, I didn't take my own advice off the tee and for some reason got in the rough. So as you know, in the spring in Ohio, here at Kinsale, the rough gets pretty thick. So most people play bad in the spring and their handicaps go up because they hit it in the rough, they try the hero shot, end up making double or triple. When a bogey's not gonna hit, not gonna hurt anybody. So if I hit it in this lie where you can't even see the ball, and I'm 200 yards away, I'm not gonna try to take a four iron out of a lie that I can't, I just can't hit it out of. It's, I'm gonna hit it, in the, I'm gonna keep it in the rough, top it, hit it over there in the water, whatever. I'm gonna take some sort of short iron, and eight iron is what I have in my hand. I know I can't get it to the green, but in my mind, a bogey's not gonna kill me. I can get a long, I can get a short iron out of that lie, no problem. Maybe not hit it as far as I normally hit an eight iron, but it's gonna stay in play. Now I can try to get up and down with the wedge. Worst case scenario, I make a, I make a five. So in doing and taking and not trying the hero shot, I have two scores in mind, a four or a five on a par four. If I try the hero shot, I don't really bring in three because I can't hit it, but I bring in five, six, seven, eight, bring in a lot of different things. So if I'm hitting this shot, big difference in this shot, because I'm not actually trying to hit a normal shot, ball position stays the same. One big difference out of this lie is we need to get steep to get that thing out. So trying to get steep, I'm gonna lean into my left side a little more. So instead of this being my normal setup with spine tilt, I'm gonna lean. So now I am getting a little steeper. From here, I use my chest. Take it back and just gouge it out of that rough. And it's gonna run down there, hopefully get up and down for par, but a bogey's not gonna kill me.